Hey guys, I'm Touch Boy, and today we are watching Black Panther teaser trailer 1. I'm so excited for this movie. I can't believe how excited I am, but he was so good in Captain America Civil War, and um, I'm, I'm truly, 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 truly excited. Um, I still think it's a little low on my list of excitement. I'm looking forward to Thor Ragnarok. I can't wait for Captain Marvel, especially after Wonder Woman just came out. I still haven't seen it. I think I'm going to go see it tomorrow. Um, but, nah, man, I want to go see that movie. And, um, because apparently it's amazing. And I'm just, I'm, I'm very excited um, for female movies now. But I am excited for this as well because it is another diverse, incredible movie and something that we need to see become more of a norm. Do you know what I mean? In, especially in superhero movies. So I'm very excited for this. This is Black Panther. This is teaser trailer one. Let's go. Oh. Tell me something. What do you know? Hey! Edward Ross. Ross. <gasps> It's a third world country. Textiles, shepherds, cool outfits, all the front. Martin Freeman. Explorers have searched for it. Called it El Dorado. They looked for it in South America. But it was in Africa the whole time. I'm the only one who's seen it. And made it out alive. I said doggy. Oh, fuck me! <laughs> Bullets don't work. <laughs> okay. Intriguing. Damn! It's changing. Soon, there will only be the conquer. And the conquerors. Step into the spotlight. You are a good man. Step into the spotlight. Oh, I am good heart. And it's hard for a good man to be a king. Okay. It's only a teaser trailer and I'm sure that graphic will improve because obviously it did look a little CGI but I'm sure, you know, it's not out till next year so Christ, they've got, a, you know, they've got a lot of work to do. That is impressive but apart from that ending graphic, I... Um, so here we have some ultraviolet lighting. Um, and here we have Andy Serkis and Martin Freeman just sat down and we had chit chat, which is lovely, really. Um, I'm really glad Andy Serkis is back. I'm I'm excited to see him play a character that is not of CGI nature. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like it's been like a long while. <laughs> um, Martin Freeman just not look impressed here. Um, okay, so here they're discussing Wakanda um, and everything that sort of goes with it. I like the continuity that he's still not got his arm useless. Claws. He lost his arm. That's very good. Um, right, okay, so here we have some kind of, like, a ceremony, perhaps? We saw people fighting in the in the water, maybe this is how they, he became Black Panther? Who knows? Um, and then, oh, and then there's, like, this ship, and the ship takes off. That must be what he's getting off of to get there, right. Okay, interesting, you think you just walk, lazy bastard. But anyway, um, these people pull up here, and they're like, let's go kill this dog. Person, dog's like, not today, bitch, because I got a cat on my side, and Battle Panther's like, you bitches, time to die. Uh, I just, I do love this scene though. Like, let's shoot bullets at him. Oh, that didn't work. Let's shoot more bullets at him. You just run the fuck away, wouldn't you? Like, I mean, I know he's gonna catch you, but you'd still run the fuck away. <laughs> um, he's damn strong. Um, and we get to see a little bit more of the supporting players here. I don't know much about this film yet, to be honest, usually I'll do a bit of research into the cast before I know about it. But I can already tell she's gonna be my favourite. Um <laughs> just 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 for the way oh I do like this shot though. I like right, okay what I really like about this is how it blends new and old. Like you've got a thatched sort of house on top of a skyscraper here. It's, it's very oh it's very different isn't it? I, I don't know. It's very cool. It's very cool. Um and we have this guy uh, looking like he's breaking out, useless claw. So, 
Now, you, you know, I knew from the moment that this lady did this and this guy goes flying over there that this, she was going to be my favourite. Um, here we have him dressed as some kind of psychopathic doctor, you know. He's really pulling out all the stops for this one. Um, but I don't know much about who these people are at the moment, but I can't wait to find out more and sort of learn about them. I'm sure you guys will tell me in the comments below who they are. Um, especially you comic fans, you'll, you'll definitely know. Um, but I just find it very interesting, and it, like this seems to be like some kind of gladiator match there, and this guy seems pretty badass. Um, he's also wearing the uh, the sort of like the black one thing on his neck, so that's interesting. Um, that's all like the symbol for my kind of. Um, I, you see, there's a lot of there's a lot of things I don't know. The only shot I didn't like was this one because it's just so CGI at the moment. But you gotta be honest and say. It, well, it was more there that it became more CGI, but you've got to be honest and say that it's going to look better than that at the end of the movie, you know what I mean, like, it, it will look better than that, they they obviously are just, you know, running through, like, editing and CGI and stuff, so you can't you can't really judge them on CGI for for that, you know, um, but it does look like an incredible movie and I'm very excited. Thank you very much for watching, my next video will be Buffy and then Doctor Who later. I love you all, Ruby Chibi's tomorrow with Red, Red, Blue and Buffy. Bye!